Or to this, there is a beacon of hope now for residents of the watercolor apartments. It comes from a Travis Baptist Church, which is just across the street from the complex. Andrew Christensen tells us about their outreach efforts for those who are living in the shadow of crime. Church is not a club. It's meant to be a group of people that are reaching out around them to bring people closer to Christ. That church, Travis Baptist Church on Weber Road. It's a mature church, an older church, uh, that has become very concerned for the community around it. The church offers a free Bible study for kids in the neighborhood who may need a home away from home. Volunteers say these types of events give the church more of a family feel. And people that I don't normally get to see that we outreach to, um, it's a blessing to see us ministering to the community. Earlier this month, this area was the backdrop to an incident that shocked the community. Officer Manuel Dominguez was shot while responding to a domestic call at the watercolor apartment complex. Members of Travis Baptist Church gathered $300 to donate to the officer's GoFundMe. Members here believe in walking in Jesus' shoes, donating 122 pairs of shoes to kids. It is priceless. I tell all of my volunteers, everybody needs to take a turn in the shoe store because the little ones, they put them on their feet and they start running and they start jumping. And for Pastor Byrne and the church, they're hoping that outreach will bring people closer to God. We can put a Band-Aid, but only Jesus can heal. And so we're, uh, we're trying to use those things as a chance to share with them about the one who can really change their lives. Soon the church will have a trunk or treat event in October and a toy collection for international children in December. In Corpus Christi, Andrew Christensen, Chris 6 News.